Cleveland police put a stop to what could have been a very dangerous situation this morning. They picked up three men in a pickup truck, and officers say the trio had stolen manhole covers in the back. News Channel 5 reporter Shay Harris joins us in the newsroom with just how dangerous this can be, Shay. Well, Lee, as you can imagine, this presents many different dangers, including those you can't see above ground. Here they sit, three men handcuffed in the back of a Cleveland police car this morning along East 65th and Hubbard. According to police, the trio caught red-handed with manhole covers loaded up on this pickup truck. If we find them, we're going to put them in jail. First Energy spokesperson Mark Durbin says manhole cover thefts are a serious matter. The manholes lead to a series of underground vaults where power is routed from one location to another. If that manhole cover is not there, um, in addition to the danger of somebody potentially falling into that, it would also allow potentially salt and rain and snow to get down in there as well to, to cause problems to our equipment, which could lead to a possible power outage. Durbin says these crimes are happening more and more frequently. If they don't have an illuminating company outfit on and they're monkeying with one of our manhole covers, they're not there to fix something. They're probably there to steal something. This is a manhole cover that somebody stole. Uh, from the street last week, and it's they've stolen them about three or four times from this area. Jeff Mingus owns a business in the area. He says the culprits keep coming back, and it makes him mad. Yeah, it does, because I don't want my car falling in, and I don't want uh, trucks falling in and, and uh, delaying shipments out of, for our plant. Scrap steel right now is worth 10 cents a pound. Um, there's certain items that you just don't buy, and manhole covers are one of them. It all boils down to money for the thieves. But Durbin says in the end, it's the thieves who will pay. We're considering offering a reward for uh, someone who provides information that would lead to the arrest and conviction of somebody stealing a manhole cover. Now, the city of Cleveland says this is very costly for them and for taxpayers, as these manhole covers can cost up to $200 each in addition to personnel costs. Now, they've been seeing them missing 10 to 20 at one time, and they're not budgeted right now, but this is definitely something they're looking into. And they also say if you see someone committing this crime, you should contact police immediately. On your side, Shay Harris, News Channel 5. Okay, Shay, thanks very much.